Hey friends, Dave here with Transfer Express and today we are talking all things relabeling for custom decorated apparel. We're going to be covering the legal requirements of what you need on your garments, the favorite garments with removable tags that we have, the sizing and placement for those inside tags, and then we're even going to cover a few different ways that you can apply them. But we have got a ton to cover today, so what do you say? Let's get to it. If you are new to Transfer Express, we are the world's largest supplier of screen printed and digital heat transfers, heat presses, free customizable designs, wholesale apparel, and expert advice to help grow your t-shirt business. If you haven't already subscribed, we are kicking out new videos like this one every single week. Now, in the past few years, we've seen an exponential rise of relabeling apparel in the apparel decorating business with many garment manufacturers taking note and offering super easy tearaway tags on more styles than ever. Now these tearaway tags don't require any seam ripping or knives or specialized sewing tools. You just simply pull them away and they are gone. Now one thing that relabeling really does is boost the value of your printed t-shirt. My favorite example that I like to use is Hanes or Fruit of the Loom. Outside of the printing industry, these companies have grown a reputation for being incredibly inexpensive garments. And many customers associate the brand names with that six pack of blank t-shirts for $12 at Target. Now this could hurt the value of your services when the customer sees that tag on the inside of a printed shirt. Now, while it may not be the same style as those bulk retail packs you pick up at Walmart, the customer has already associated cheap with the brand, and even if you're selling a printed t-shirt for $12, they're still looking at the shirt and wondering if your printing is really worth that $10 alone. Well, this is where relabeling comes in. Now, the t-shirt becomes your own your brand or your customer's brand, not another brand or Hanes, Fruit of the Loom, Guild and All Style, none of that. So that's immediately removing any preconceived notions of the cost of the t-shirt. With that aside, before we dive into the how-tos, let's cover the legal requirements of what inside tag prints are for. Here in the United States, the Federal Trade Commission enforces these labeling requirements for all textiles, footwear, and apparel. Now, things that must be present when sold to the end user are the fiber content, the country of origin, the manufacturer or dealer identity, and the care instructions. So keep these specific things in mind when you are designing your tag prints. While the FTC isn't inspecting every shirt on the shelf or sold from an Etsy store, one spot your shirts may get flagged is the border. Now customs from many countries need to confirm the country of origin as it relates to certain taxes and tariffs. So if you're planning on shipping your goods out of the country, be sure to include the required information on your inside tag. With that out of the way, let's chat some of our favorite garments with removable tags. Now, the next time that you're shopping for wholesale apparel, be it at transferexpress.com in that wholesale apparel section, or even from vendors like Sanmar, just search the description to see if the style has a tearaway label. It will always say right there on the site, so there's no guessing if the label could be easily removed or not. So my trusty favorite, of course, is the Next Level 3600 t-shirt. Now it feels premium for a not so premium price, and with the label removed, you would think it was an old American apparel tee. The next up, pretty much anything from District. I love their fashion forward modern styles, and every single style of their products that I've dealt with features an absolutely awesome paper tearaway label. I absolutely love the relaxed fit and feel on this 5.4 ounce ring spun cotton. It's very comparable to other basic t-shirts, but for sometimes half the cost. Now, no list would be complete without mentioning the Bella Canvas 3001. It seems to be the industry standard these days for a super soft premium tee and also features a super easy tearaway tag, making relabeling very easy for you. 
But you get the idea, there are so many styles out there that come with removable tags, so all you have to do is look for them. Now even on the flip side, having a sewn in garment dyed label like those Uncomfort Colors or the brand new Beach Wash series from Port & Company or even the Comfort Wash from Hanes seems to be on the rise. You could still put your own branding on the inside, underneath, or even beside that woven manufacturer's label. And this is great for skirting any requirements because the tag already has all of those requirements covered. You just have to focus on putting your own branding or logo in there. Now before I show you some of the different ways that we could decorate tag prints, I want to explore some different designs and sizing. Now typically we're recommending to stay within a 2.5 to 3 inch wide area for an inside tag. Now any larger, and it gets quite large on the inside of the shirt, and sometimes could show through the back and be super distracting. And any smaller than that, two and a half inches, and you may have issues with some of the smaller text closing up. Now an Easy View Online Designer here at TransferExpress.com, we have got a ton of different variations of inside tag prints right here that you can easily customize. All you have to do is open them up here in the design space, double click and type in whatever you want. Now you could see here just how easy it is to adjust these to meet your needs or even make them truly unique by also using the upload art function to upload your own logo and combine your logo with these pre-made tags. Now the beauty of Easy View and screen printed transfers is really the ability to group them all on one sheet, also known as gang sheeting. And at that two and a half inch sizing, you could fit 30 up on one standard gang sheet or even 42 on our brand new jumbo sized gang sheets. So at say 18 sheet quantity, the standard size regular 11 and a quarter by 14 inch gang sheets, we are looking around $3.87 per sheet for that one color print. Now that's going to equal out to just 12 cents per tag and 10 cents per tag in that 42 number on the jumbo sheet scenario that we mentioned earlier. Yeah, I'm talking seriously cheap printing and much easier to print than inking up a screen and pulling a squeegee. Now speaking of easier than screen printing with an ink and a squeegee, let's apply some durable screen printed Plastisol ink inside tags with just our heat press. Now one of the easiest ways to decorate a tag with a heat press is just turning the shirt inside out and printing that tag location on the flat heat press, just like you would be printing the front of a t-shirt. Another method for printing inside tag prints is of course using something like a hat press. Here we're using the Clam Basic Cap Press and with a smaller platen, it makes applying the tag super easy. If you have already printed the fronts, maybe you screen printed the fronts or sublimated, it doesn't matter. Just looping the collar around that printing area isolates where your tag will print and makes it super quick and easy. Now, if we're talking about inside tag printing, we have to mention our Tag Along Platen. Now, the Pinnacle Innovation Award winner for 2021, this single platen allows you to save time and money by printing the inside tag on your shirt and the front in the same press, saving you all the extra steps and time. One impression, two locations, and with our goof-proof screen printed transfers, it is complete and printed in as fast as four seconds. But Sure enough, even if you don't have a heat press, we've seen some decent results using a Cricut Easy Press. Yes, we were very hesitant of this method at first, but after watching thousands of creators apply their inside tags on TikTok over the past year with that Cricut Press, we just had to try it. And with a little bit of technique adjustment, we were quite surprised by the results and even the wash testing we did too. If you want to see the entire process of that journey and using that Cricut Easy Press Mini, we'll have that video linked right here. 
Now, one thing that's very common in a lot of blank garments too, is the side seam tag down the left side. Most often you'll find the country of origin and washing instructions there as well. So you're able to remove the label up top by the neck and the unbranded manufacturer label down on that left hand side could cover a lot of those legal requirements that your label doesn't have to have them. But that's it. 2022 is the year for you to build more value into your custom decorated apparel or even offer your customers these rebranding opportunities that they never thought were possible. We are pushing out new videos every week here on the Transfer Express YouTube channel. So if you're not already subscribed, what are you waiting for? As always, we are happy to help in any way we can for the apparel decorating community. If you need to reach us, you can always comment below, call or email us at info at transferexpress.com. But until next time, I'm Dave, happy pressing.